How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Sonic 2 Delta, the ROM hack for Sonic 2. So you may notice we are now in Emerald Hill Zone, which would be the first stage in regular Sonic 2, vanilla Sonic 2, if you will. However, this is the second stage, and you'll notice these little dudes who were in uh, Sonic 2 Beta have made their way into the game. It's a nice little touch by the, uh, the hack maker. Oops. Whoa! Okay, that's different. That wasn't in Sonic 2. <laughs> We're gonna take the high road, I think, because that just scared me a little bit. So if you didn't watch the first episode, Sonic 2 Delta is a ROM hack, as I mentioned a minute ago. Uh, it basically combines Sonic 2 with some Sonic 1 levels, um, some original levels, and then some levels that were incomplete in Sonic 2 Beta and then added in by the, uh, the hack creator. So it's a pretty, pretty cool little, little ROM hack. Doesn't do anything insane or drastically different, but that's kind of what I like about it. It feels still like you're playing a Sonic game. Now I'm trying to find a checkpoint here because there's a, an interesting little thing that happens with those. Although I'm realizing that if I do that I'm not going to keep my rings, so I think I'll show you what happens when you go to a checkpoint on the next act. There's one right there, but whatever. Yeah, I'll just show you guys the next act. And continues. Who knows, maybe I'm gonna need him. Alright, special stage number three. Uh, it is worth noting that these are just the the original ones. These haven't been modified any way, uh, in any way for the ROM hack. So I'm still pretty decent at these, just from remembering them from my childhood. These stages do take a little bit of uh, getting used to. If you stand on, say, the wall, you will actually slide down it like that. Or if you go up here, obviously you'll fall down, so you kind of have to use your momentum and just lightly tap the controller sometimes to uh, get those rings when they come in in odd patterns. There's not really anything designed in these to sort of trick you for the most part. Like if you see a certain pattern, it usually stays as that pattern, you know. Although sometimes they'll throw that the uh, bombs at you in circles like that, but it's again, it's never in a way that you wouldn't be able to dodge it. Even if you don't know it's coming, you will always have a chance to dodge it. So these aren't designed to make you rage quit or anything. And once you get some of the basic patterns down, I already said this, but... Uh, the same sorts of patterns are used, not the same patterns, but the same kinds of patterns are used throughout the game, so... Uh, once you get some of the basic ones down, you're in pretty good shape. Alright, Emerald number 3. So because this is actually a Sonic 2 level, not a Sonic 1 level, there's only going to be one opportunity to get an Emerald on this level. Now let's go ahead and grab 50 rings, and I'll show you what happens when you go into a checkpoint. Those guys, man. Get out of here. Aw, what are the odds of that? Take it nice and slow, grab as many rings as I can here. I believe there's one up here. Am I wrong? I might be wrong. There's one. <laughs> Too bad we didn't have enough rings. Oh well. 
I know there's one at the very end, so we'll just hit that one. Yeah, there's one right there. Let's get that one. Okay, so normally in Sonic 2, you hit one of these checkpoints when you have 50 rings. That's how you get into the special stages. In this uh, version, it's been modified to work like Sonic 1, where if you finish the level with 50 rings. But uh, this is what happens if you hop on in. Yeah, this is uh, the Sonic 1 special stage. Except what you're actually going for is not Chaos Emerald, but is in fact an extra life. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm not quite as good at these as I am at the, uh, the Sonic 2 ones, but I'm alright. There we go. So yeah, extra life. Not really anything that big. And I think everything spawns... Oh no, I do still have my rings. Okay. Whatever. Let's go ahead and finish the stage up, shall we? Ah, didn't see that guy. We're gonna have to go up against what qualifies as probably the easiest boss in all of Sonic history. Maybe I'm wrong, but uh, let me know which one you think is the easiest. <laughs> well, apparently he's making quick work of me. For those of you who don't know, generally it's eight hits to kill a boss in the Sonic universe. Watch out for this part, because he will shoot that off at you. See ya. Alright, so that's been the end of Stage 2, or Zone 2, uh, Emerald Hill Zone. I will be back next time, where we'll be moving on to a different zone, uh, which I'm not quite sure what it is. I don't think it's Chemical Plant yet, so we'll see uh, when we get there. Till next time, kaboom.